Okay, well, we know how expensive Legos are, but how do they compare to precious metals? Well, let's find out. Creativity, nostalgia, business. What are you building with Legos? Oh, my daughter is here. I'm, you want to do the experiment with me? What are you going to build? I'm, I'm not building, I'm telling them uh, how much Lego costs. See, I'm putting it in here, and then we're weighing it with the scale. I'm gonna have it on the screen for silver, platinum, gold, palladium, and there's one more I don't have here, but uh, it'll be on the screen. And the value per ounce, and that's what we're gonna weigh. We're gonna weigh an ounce of Legos and we're gonna compare it to metals. Nice. Precious metals, yes. Like silver is $17 per ounce, platinum is $930.60, gold is $1,477.40, and palladium. Is its container. Palladium is a thousand nine hundred thirty-four dollars and five cents, and the other one, which you'll see on the screen, I can't remember off the top of my head, is about six thousand six thousand something dollars per ounce. And we're gonna compare the value of Legos to the value of these precious metals and see how it uh, compares. Actually, you know what? For fun, is imagine all of these screws right here. Okay, so imagine all these screws right here. You want to put the other one in there, Isla? Stack it on top. So that's one ounce of screws. So now imagine if you had that amount of platinum or gold or palladium or any of these precious metals. That's pretty much the amount we're talking about and it's in the thousands of dollars. Alright, well let's start the experiment. Actually, I'm doing it again. My battery died on me, so I actually have all the calculations here so this will go a little faster let's start with the two by two white brick right here uh, we're basically gonna stack it up until we get one ounce and then we'll calculate based on the unit price multiplied by the number of uh, pieces we have and that will get us the total value of the white bricks for one ounce so let's keep going Okay, so for one uh, ounce, we have 22 units because I had already calculated earlier. And that's a total of six, uh, six cents per unit multiplied by 22 units. It's a dollar and 32 cents. Nowhere near the value of any of these metals. So let's move on to the next one. Now let's try. This one, the 4x4 light bluish gray plate. Stack it up again, see what we get. We have 0.5 ounces, 0.7. I think that's it. 0.9. Yeah, one. Okay. So the value of this is around. I have it right here, where is it? I had it for the dark bluish gray, but it should be similar. It was seven cents for the dark bluish gray uh, per unit. And we have a total of, the total is 91 uh, cents. Basically, it's very low. I had calculated that one. Now if we move on to Something lighter and much smaller and valuable per unit, the dark tan 2x2 tile. Could have put, put a whole bunch of these in here. Let's see how many we need for one ounce. So I had calculated this one as well, it's 8 cents per unit based on the BrickLink average uh, price for the past 6 months. We have 56 units, I know it doesn't look like it, it's over 50 units. 56 units, a total of $4.48, we're still far behind silver. Bright green leaf with one stud and three leaves. Well it's called a plant, right, if you search it. 
So the value per unit is 10 cents right now on Bricklink. So let's see how many of these we need to get one ounce. So let's count. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, hundred twenty-three. All right, hundred twenty-three. And the math on this one is hundred twenty-three times ten cents, twelve dollars and thirty cents. Well, what do you guys think? Are there any other parts that are more valuable than this plant with the three leaves? Uh, if you can find parts that are more valuable, make sure to comment down below. Actually, now, if one minifigure weighs about one ounce, probably maybe a little more than an ounce, I'm guessing. What if you have... Uh, the Krang minifigure, which is worth about $250 or $300. I'm just going off memory, but there are minifigures out there that are worth that much. Let's say a minifigure is worth $300. Multiply that by 10. That's $3,000 for one ounce of that particular minifigure. That surpasses platinum and gold, guys and palladium so the most expensive uh, minifigures can compete with silver platinum and gold actually can beat silver platinum gold palladium but not rhodium but that's still pretty good so this test shows that legos can compete with precious metals uh, minifigures especially but other parts can come close to beating silver, actually can, some of them can, can come close to it. Alright guys, well, make sure to like and subscribe and uh, I will see you guys in the next video.